polynomials types of polynomials at first types of polynomials types of polynomials based on based on terms that means based on number of terms first one monomial if polynomial has only one term only one term it is called it is called monomial for example 3x 4x 7x square 8x cube so on like this that means if polynomial has only one term so 3x is monomial 4x is monomial if we have only one term in the polynomial it is called monomial next binomial if polynomial has two terms it is called it is called binomial one term it is monomial if you have two terms in the polynomial it is binomial that means 3x plus 5 7x cube plus 5x square 8y square plus 2 so all these are binomials and I already told that the terms are separated by plus or minus not multiplication that means here 3 is one term x is not x is one term that is not wrong that is wrong 3x entire will be one term that means even though if you take 4xyz in this example 4xyz this is also single term and this is also monomial in three variables remember that the terms are separated by plus and minus trinomial if polynomial has three terms It is called trinomial. For example, three x square plus five x plus four, five x cube, six x square plus seven. So three terms in a polynomial, then it is called trinomial. Multinomial. If polynomial, if polynomial has more than three terms, more than three terms, it is called multinomial. More than three terms, that is called multinomial. Next, <clears throat> types of polynomial based on degree. Now, based on degree, the polynomials are divided. Let me discuss about them. first one zero polynomial
zero is called zero polynomial only zero is called zero polynomial and its degree is undefined and remember this carefully zero polynomial is called zero only zero only zero the number zero only called as zero polynomial its degree is undefined constant polynomial a polynomial a polynomial of degree zero is called is called constant polynomial the degree is zero then it is called constant polynomial examples all numbers five six nine all these are examples how can you say the degree of the constant polynomial is zero let's consider five can i write it as five into x power zero because x power zero is equal to one that means five x power zero the degree is zero this is the degree the degree is zero so all constants comes under constant polynomial linear polynomial a polynomial of degree a polynomial of degree 1 is called linear polynomial that means if polynomial has degree 1 it is called linear polynomial for example 6x 7x plus 5 3x plus 7 all these are linear because here highest power in each and every expression is 1 so the degree is obviously one these are all called as linear polynomials quadratic polynomial quadratic polynomial a polynomial of degree 2 is called quadratic polynomial example 3x square plus 5x plus 7 4x square plus 5y square so on If the polynomial has degree two, it is called quadratic polynomial. Three x squared plus five x plus seven. Four x. So remember the thing. Don't confine that linear polynomial. Linear polynomial has only two variables, or single variable, and quadratic polynomial has two or three. We can have linear polynomial in several variables, like this. See example one example. Three x plus four y plus seven z plus. 8w plus 9p plus 8q. We can write any any number of variables. Similarly here also. But observe that the degree of the entire polynomial, entire expression is one itself. There is no other power than one in any term. So then it is called linear polynomial. It is called linear polynomial one variable. This is two. This is six variables. We can write 7x plus 8y. Linear polynomial is two variables. And moreover, remember that. linear polynomial in single one variable is called simple equation simple polynomial simple polynomial that what you learned before earlier classes now fifth 
fifth one cubic polynomial cubic polynomial a polynomial of degree 3 is called cubic polynomial example 5x cube plus 4x square plus 7 or 6x cube that means the degree of the polynomial should be 3 degree 3 it may be single variable to variables li like linear and quadratic but the degree of the expression must be equal to 3 then it is called cubic polynomial by quadratic polynomial a polynomial of degree 4 is called by quadratic polynomial that means here the polynomial should have the degree 4 then it is by quadratic polynomial for example 11 y for 4 9 x power 4 plus 3 x square plus 7 x so all these are examples for the by quadratic polynomial that means here the polynomial should contain the degree 4 and remember that if the polynomial has degree more than 4 it is called generally polynomial that means the polynomial of nth order polynomial of degree n that is polynomial of degree 6 polynomial of degree 7 like that we may call that 